Then we've got the V, W, X, Y, and Z, which are, which we can pretty much do. The V, W, X, and Z are virtually identical. The Y is slightly different. So let's just we'll do these on the lower line. V. Don't forget to change the pen angle to about 45 degrees to come down that second stroke, making a nice little point at the bottom. W is double V, as you'll know if you speak French. So I'm starting the next stroke where I would start the second stroke of the V and I'm coming down again like this and then I'm making this into a V and then I'm joining this across to there there's my W and X, Y, and Z, will I get it all in? Maybe not. X. So that's exactly the same, except bigger. Now, why? That's the question, isn't it? Why? Why is there something and not nothing? Big philosophical question. So I'm going to put the why up here, then I can. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. Why? I'm doing the V which is only half the size, half the height and rather wider, like that. And then I'm going to add the trunk of the Y. I always think of the Y as a tree for some reason. And now I'm going to do the Z. This is a basic horizontal stroke which you find on the crossbar of the lowercase t. <coughs> you also find it on the top of the capital T. Now I'm lowering my pen angle to virtually horizontal and I'm bringing the line down here and then horizontal again. Sorry back to 30 degrees I mean for that final stroke the reason we need to change the pen angle there is because if we keep the pen at 30 degrees uh, when we come down we get a very very thin stroke and it really doesn't look very good so this strengthens the, the Z and when you think in in the olden days when people didn't have spectacles and they were reading but in very poor light, something like this, a Z with a very thin diagonal, um, this would disappear for them if they had poor eyesight and bad lighting conditions. This is why this is thickened up, to increase the legibility of it. So. There we are, there's the first few of the Roman capital alphabet and I'll do the rest of them in the forthcoming videos. And don't forget that I'm watching you. Um, I think, have another go at that X, sir, over there, yes you, yes, yes, you. Have another go at that X, do it again. 
and don't forget to change your pen angle on the V either. Okay, 